I didn't get anything done yesterday. The only thing I managed to get done was fixing my nails. Look, kind of, this hand is definitely the best hand because I'm right-handed, so. And deep cleaning our espresso machine that's new second hand so like it needed deep cleaning before we could do anything with it but i just started sneezing all day like my body just went into like a histamine overdrive and i was sneezing legitimately like every five seconds and now my abs hurt <laughs> and i'm really afraid to have ab i'm a afraid i took too many antihistamines and i'm b afraid it's gonna happen again today i'm so puffy because i just woke up to be copious girl. I peed, but now I'm hungry, so let's go make food. Also, yeah, I don't really get spots that often. I've had a lot recently. Well, actually, I don't know why. I feel like it's just because I was eating like trash and it wasn't seeming like my body was just going through the ringer. So it's not a pleasant time. Oh my god, I'm gonna drop everything. I got what I was saying. I don't want them alone. We haven't used our coffee machine. I don't think anybody's up yet. And I don't want to use it without them. But I really need a coffee. I might just make a small crappy one. Cause I have more than one cup of coffee in a day anyway. And sometimes I feel like you just gotta do what you gotta do, you know? Let's do that. and sweaty and sticky and I feel like creatively sticky I was I'm kind of lately I feel very not overwhelmed and not underwhelmed and not whelmed I'm like I feel like I'm at a sticking point like I'm just stuck I'm just stuck the stuff that I'm making artistically is not bringing me joy it's not making me happy I don't feel like there's any personality to it and I have something in my brain that I want to try, but I don't know how to like conceive of it physically. And I, oh, I do kind of, I want to do it big. I've got paper here that I was going to test it on, but I really like working big. I love art. I love making art, but I've always, I've always struggled with what is my style. But like I do drawings, which is like, they're very, very detailed and they're kind of close to hyper-realism. And I love doing that but that's the stuff which I don't feel like there's that much of me in it. The only thing that I think I put of myself into that is is like the choice of reference and the composition of the reference on the page. And I just bored. And I used to do these really big, fun, abstract paintings. Basically, I have always thoroughly enjoyed two completely different styles of art. I enjoy the therapeutic meditative process of drawing the super detailed human figures that I do. And I enjoy the loud, expressive, personified version of me internally in the abstract side of things. So I want to try to get back to like the joy that I found from it when I was a child. And I so I, yeah, anyhow. Do you know what, fuck it, I'm gonna get a big one. BLB, call you back. Oh, fuck. Ow. That's really bad for teeth, isn't it? I got this 
little pencil extender thing and it because I use my pencils and I take them down to a nub as you can see it's very small and it makes them big again get one might get rid of that i've been doing these like little cat doodles for like a week now they're very fun i just don't know where they fit but i like doing them they make me feel like a kid again i'm gonna stretch it up a bit i think actually This is the scary bit. It's drawing the person, which I've not done at this scale for a long time, so. loving it so far but i feel like it's one of those things where i'm like the closer i get to it being finished the more i'll like it allowing me to oh i need to rush it out like the thing goes it's the thing i think i'm going to adjust the bed a little bit like i kind of want to bring this up i think i think the bed is too big for what i was picturing in my head and the human is too small so i think maybe next time i do what i originally was planning which was start with the person and then put the bed around the person like get the scale of the person right and then do the bed but i am getting closer to something which i'm enjoying and honestly i feel like it could look kind of dope if i did the figures in the really realistic style that i do and then have everything else be super like sketchy and almost kid-like like like a child has come along and like drawn on the wall i like that but that will take so much longer <laughs> i don't know if i've got the patience for that right now be very fun to do and to come together and to you know, just like see what comes about but I feel a little bit better having actually done something with my hands and made something <sighs> being an artist with no time oh gosh you get this kind of bubble and build up of necessary creation it's already 9 p.m but I'm exhausted I'm going to get up early tomorrow, so it's my bedtime. It is my bedtime. Mm -hmm.